will saucer it out of the zone. Gets past Gavin Yates. Nice touch pass from Ganzatov. Tomasi comes skating in. Poke check from Mackinanama. Keeps that puck out of the crease. Stolen away. And Bartlett now coming in, waiting for reinforcements as he crosses over the line. High saucer over to Sergev. Fought off by Mackinanama. Two minutes gone here in the Greenlight Network second period. Fitzgerald crossing over. The secret weapon playing it back. Now one touch, a one-timer, they score! Binghamton gets on the board, four on four, goal, and the Black Bears, first goal of the night. Looks like it's Kyle Steffen leading the charge, Brooks, and what an addition he's been to this squad since coming over. A beautiful pass right on his tape. The Black Bears finally break the ice on Kozlowski. But elected to go back towards the blue line. Now cross ice pass, low angle, one touch, they score again! Just like that, the game is tied. Colin Fitzgerald leading the way for the Black Bears, and this game is tied up at 2-2 in a blink of an eye, just like that. The offensive-minded defenseman, so smart with the puck, one touch pass to Stefan, slows it down and says thank you very much, Kozlowski. Momentum on the side of the Black Bears. Leeson dropping it back for Lord. A wrist shot gloved by Mackinanama. And he'll hang on for both sides. Leeson and Weber back up to the point. Five seconds left to go. Bonds, wrister, save made. Rebound, stuffed chance denied. Kozlowski fighting for the referee. Not blowing the whistle yet. It's still available. Loose puck. They score that time. It's cashed in. Dakota Bond. On the power play, and the Black Bears have the lead for the first time tonight. Oh, wow. Well, that was uh, a series of events there. The puck being knocked down. The puck still in the crease. And Dakota Bond, the FPHL defenseman of the year, cashes in. And who else do you expect? Run into partially by Jesse Anderson. Gets it ahead to Jacob Black. Puck behind the Watertown net. No, check that. Binghamton net. Or a shot caught by Mack and Anima with 12.29 left to go by that third line. Yeah, they kept that puck in the other end of the ice, tiring out the Wolves, and that's going to come in handy with Stefan streaking. Rebound scored. Stefan, the initial shot, cashed in. Black Bears lead by two. Gavin Yates crashing to the net. Binghamton by a pair. Yeah, Gavin Yates just kept crashing, kept going and he's able to tap it home. Binghamton doubles their lead. Black Bears, Lord fires a shot. Mackinanama made the save. Now Mercurio, top of the umbrella, holding for a wrist shot, blocked on the way through. Fitzgerald tries to slap it out. Rebound, absorbed by Mackinanama, but couldn't corral it. 20 seconds left to go in the power play. Leeson cuts through the middle of the ice. A shot snared by Mackinanama. One back, though, by the Wolves. They still have a final chance. Mercurio out in front. Mackinanama got his glove on top of it. Kirby will slap it around, maybe looking for the final one. This one shot down the length of the ice. It's not going to matter. Mack and Animal will put it right back towards the Watertown net, and that is going to be the end of the game here tonight. Binghamton wins game one of the Commissioner's Cup quarterfinals against the Watertown Wolves by a final score of 4-2. to two.